Hi everyone, today we are going to learn about microscope. We are going to learn about the parts of a microscope and their functions. We use microscope to magnify small objects so that they can be observed and studied. I'll start from the bottom. First, the base, the bottom of a microscope, used for support. Then we got the light source. This could be a mirror or a lamp. The light will be directed through the diaphragm which will control how much light can pass through and illuminate the object so that it can be observed. Then we have the states. It is where we put the slides, the object that we observe. The slides are held by states clips to prevent it from being removed. When we are observing an object, we can select the objective lens we are using by turning or rotating the revolver. Objective lenses are located in the nose piece. The commonly used objective lenses are 4 times, 10 times, 40 times, and 100 times. Objective lens is connected to another lens called ocular lens, which is located in an eyepiece. The tube that connects the two is called Two. When you are observing things using a microscope, very likely that you have to do some focusing to get good, sharp, clear, and focused images. You don't want blurry images, do you? For this purpose, we are going to use first the coarse focus knob. If you turn this knob, the tube will go up and down. Be careful, you don't want to break the slide. Second, if you can already find the sharpest image using the coarse focus but it's not satisfactory, it's not sharp enough, then you can use the fine focus knob. This will refine your image even sharper. Well, I guess those are the parts of a microscope. Hold the arm firmly if you want to carry your microscope somewhere else, okay? Support the microscope with your other hand so that the microscope wouldn't fall and broken. They're not cheap by the way. Thank you for watching this video. May God bless you all. Be strong. Be strong.